I had a surgery on my leg in high school. I met this male nurse and I remember thinking to myself like, wow, this guy like really made a difference in my life and my mood and my recovery. I've always been Catholic and I've always wanted to help people. So when I started looking at Benedictine and I saw that they had a nursing program, I thought, wow, like maybe I could do this. The program is two years of prerequisites and then you'll apply your sophomore year to get into the program. Nursing school didn't come as easy to me as some of my classmates. I wasn't the best test taker, but I felt like God was saying, all right, it might take some work, but this is where you're supposed to be. I've been working at KU Med since I graduated in 2016, I and mean, I've been working on the mother-baby postpartum unit, and it's been awesome. <laughs> I've been teaching at Benedictine as an adjunct nursing instructor. I really encourage these students that are thinking about nursing to go for it. It's going to be hard. It's going to be difficult. But Pope Benedict said we weren't made for comfort. We were made for greatness. Everything that we do here in the School of Nursing is to really develop young men and women who have a really strong Catholic ethical foundation so they can become future nurse leaders to provide that holistic, person-centered care. Freshman, sophomore year, I asked myself, am I supposed to keep going with this? Because I was taking classes that weren't necessarily all focused in nursing. At the same time, I was surrounded by amazing friends that are pushing me to be a better man, that loved God, and that were trying to live a life of charity and giving. Our students come in after having two years of pre-nursing classes and general college requirements at Benedictine College. That helps them to be great communicators, be very compassionate, really look at the patient with the dignity as Christ would view them. Junior year, when I got into the nursing program, we start talking about how self-giving nursing is. That was confirmation like, okay, I was growing as someone who could sacrifice and love better. And now that I'm out in the clinical setting and I'm applying for jobs, I'm really thinking, this is how I'm gonna make a difference and love people and use the formation and the growth that I've had at Benedictine to go out there and be a better nurse. Nursing is a calling, it's a profession, it's more than just a job. I've discharged parents home to an empty car seat. But at the same time, I've had patients come back for their second and I'm now on to their third baby and they request for me to come see their new child. We need good Catholic nurses today because we're living in a culture of death. We need to support life, be the light out there and be those people that the suffering can lean on. We are the Mother Teresa Nursing Center, and so the call within a call that she speaks of, for me, is just like encountering people. Because suffering is how the purity of love can be shown and impact that person for the rest of their life.